Hey guys, I hope I'm centered here. Hey guys, my name is Diego Mariscal and I know I haven't posted a video in about a year or so, but it's been kind of a struggle. I really haven't um, thought about what I want to talk about, but I was um, looking at another YouTuber uh, called Jack's Gap and he or his twin brother actually, they were talking about um, the impact that they had made through social media, through their channel, and that really inspired me to create a change and to start finally using this space and this platform to create my own change. I love to talk, I love to make videos, and I also, I'm a very strong disabilities advocate. So why not combine those two experiences and those two passions and make something, even if it only reaches one person, um, we can make a difference. Along those lines, I want to talk about this article that I read. The article talked about inspirational porn and how um, you guys had to have seen this before. Um, is this pictures of kids who have disabilities and they're doing, you know, everyday tasks and how underneath their action it says the only disability in life is attitude. And the article was critiquing these pictures because it said, you know what, you are objectifying disability. You are not caring about the individual, but you are saying, oh, just because he he or she has a disability that makes that activity as usual in everyday life activity as it may be just because that individual has a disability it makes it so much more inspirational so you are bottom line object objectifying those who have disability and I thought it was a really interesting article um, to a certain extent I agreed but then um, I started kind of analyzing and talking to some other people um, at Teleton and other organizations and, and one argument that I found really interesting was um, that this guy said, you know what, um, we are all looking for inspiration, whether it is from a friend, from a teacher, from a partner, from you know, someone who we wish to be like on our jobs, something like that. We are all looking for inspiration is a human experience, right? So it's inevitable that society looks at disability through that perspective. The only thing that I would have to say is it's an inevitable consequence, but that doesn't mean that we should promote it, right? Those images that say the only disability in life is attitude are not... There's one picture, for example, where there's this runner um, The problem with that is that those legs cost a lot of money and not everyone who has a disability can afford those legs. So, so is it really the only disability attitude? Is it really? Um, I always find it funny that whenever I go to clubs or whenever I go out, people always tend to smile or open the door for me or just be nicer, you know, nicer to me. And I really, really appreciate it, but I see that it is because I have a disability. I know that it wouldn't happen otherwise. So, um, because, you know, if I'm sitting down like this, you don't notice that I have a disability. But if I stand up and I walk, you start to notice, you start to see that. So it's really interesting to see that shift.